Doc, um, like you escaped there, you, you can't be happy, with, uh, especially with that first half. Is that close to the worst first half under your coaching? No, yeah, look, uh, yeah, the first half wasn't great. I thought, um, yeah, we, we, we came back from 18-3, so uh, I said to the guys afterwards, you know, that's one thing, they never give up scored to, to score 28 points, they stayed calm half time um, and, and, and calm during the second half. So I think I'd much rather focus maybe on that, uh, the 28 points they scored in the second half. I thought that was really good. But the first half didn't go our way as we planned. I thought we created some opportunities. We didn't capitalise and, and they, they had two great opportunities which they finished off. Uh, in the tactical kicking, uh, that's probably not exactly what you yeah, I don't, I, I don't think our kicking game was functioning. Mm -hmm. uh, that's probably the one reason uh, why we we struggled to get out of our half. You know, so yeah, probably one thing that we will have to improve. See a lot of off the ball stuff there at the moment. It's very seldom that we see you so emotional, or irritated. Oh, oh, oh. I was thinking of what um, Coach Stick said yesterday. You're very angry, man. But today, it's very first time I saw you so emotional. <laughs> Yeah, those things happened in the game. Um, obviously, I think they got under our skin. You know, I th th things weren't going our way in the first half. We couldn't get them all um, going. And yeah, uh, obviously we did a couple of things out of character. But yeah, they what they wanted to do, they they did in the first half. Everything was going on their term. Our moles weren't really going. Um, but like Coach said, the way we came back in the first I mean, there wasn't panic. Like, we didn't feel like at any stage that there's no ways we're going to come back into the game because we know what we're capable of and we stuck to it. We went mall after mall until, you know, and we, you know, we want to we wanted to work at the beginning, but it didn't. But after a while, it did, it did pay off. Um, Coach, can you take us through Damien's full game performance from being assured at the back and be a critical second playmaker in the second half? Yeah, I thought Damien did well. I, th um, I mean, like we said during the week, um, we, he's a project, and 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 uh, yeah, he's been a project since uh, 2018, and slowly, slowly giving him more game time, more experience, um, and more confidence within our uh, system and what we would like him to do. So, um, and yeah, I think I said it in the week that he's um, he's probably our next. Franz Stein, we think he can be, uh, covering at 10, 12 and 15. And uh, yeah, today he had to cover 10 and, 10 and 15 for us and, and I thought he did it excellently. Did you also have conversations with regards to his kicking? Because that was probably the one thing that um, has been an issue at, at, at provincial level where someone else kicks at the Stormers, but he showed a huge amount of confidence in his kicking today. Yeah, uh, I, I don't know what the stats is in terms of how many shots he had and what, what I, I, he kicked well. Yeah, I'm happy. Jacques, no? Jacques just uh, on, the, on the player he, well, replaced at fly half, I guess, Elton. Yeah. Um, I guess understandable, um, given maybe a lack of depth at fly half, that you wanted to play Elton in this game. Was it a gamble though that didn't come off and do you just think, Everything else that's been going on off the field with him, and he hasn't played much either. Um, all of those things counted against him tonight. No, I think, like I said, listen, we've we've got a couple of boxes to tick. Uh, and and that was the reason why we selected a team like we selected a team. The the, the team. I mean, yes, Elton. Uh, I think he played uh, probably less than 30 minutes in the year. So he did his shoulder, obviously went through his rehab, and then um, his Japan club didn't go into the final. So there wasn't any games uh, to expose him to. So the only exposure he had in probably the whole year was, was uh, training. You know, so we, we needed to get him in some games and, and it will always take some time for a guy who's been out for such such a long time. So lucky for us, he's, he, he got 40 minutes under the belt today. And uh, obviously, um, you can train as much as you want and you can put guys into as much uh, contact sessions as you can in, in, in trainings. But I mean, I guess there's no pressure there. And that's the thing. Um, uh, so it was, it was good for us to expose him to, to test match rugby. Jacques, was the, was the plan always to take him off after 40 or was, it, was that as a consequence of his performance? 
No, listen, no, no. The the plan what the plan is listen, you, you take a guy off whenever you feel listen, he's given everything. So sometimes we sub a guy at thirty two minutes, you know, if we if he if he doesn't uh, we've done that before. Uh, sub guys on 38 minutes. Once that we feel they've done their job and what we wanted to see, uh, uh, then we sub them and put somebody else on. Sharp performance had nothing to do. No, um, no. I think you, yeah. Listen, you, you must you must take performance in into. I mean, you're having a go at him, but you must take performance into account. He hasn't played any rugby. So so and playing against Wales, we'd be said, listen, he's playing against. We're playing against a good side, and I, and hats off to Wales. I mean, we thought it's going to be like that, and it's always like that when you play them. And um, yeah, so I th- I think. Uh, it was good. He, 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 he got through 40 minutes and he'll be better next week. Jacques, sorry, in shaping your decisions for next week, are you likely to focus on the first half more or the second half? No, we, we've got a plan. Uh, obviously, we'll have to look at injuries and, and performance. I think uh, if you look at the second half, I, th- I think that is pretty much the type of performance we're looking for. Uh, and not the first half. Things didn't go our way. We didn't start well. Uh, we didn't want to start well, but, but I mean, things didn't go our way. Uh, um, not that we didn't want to start well, but I mean, you can never plan to start well. Things happen. Uh, uh, we, I thought we started with intensity, and I thought we started with a good attitude, uh, uh, but I think our execution let ourselves down, uh, let us down there. So, um, yes, we have to improve on that. Sorry? Did Wales blow those chances, or did your pressure tell? Did Wales blow their chances? Um, I, I think how many? Ch- I, I I don't know. I, Wales in the first half had two chances to score tries, and they scored both. So I, I felt the, the opportunities they had to score, they scored in the first half. In the second half, I felt they had opportunity with them all, and they scored with them all. So I thought they had their chances. You can maybe say, listen, Dan missed the kick at goal, but I mean, I, th- I thought he, he kicked well in the whole game. So. Uh, yeah, maybe I, I thought they capitalised on the chances that they had, maybe missed one opportunity. Uh, Jock, what does it say about you know some of the lack of fluidity in your guys' attack? That you played against the 13 men or 12 even against Wales uh, today in the second half, and they had four yellow cards, but you found it very difficult to break them down. What, what does it say about the way you are in an attacking mode at the moment? I actually thought. To be quite fair, I thought we, 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 our carries was good uh, at some stages uh, in the game. Like I say, execution did go down. Um, or our execution wasn't where we, where we would like it to be, but I think it's always going to be like that. Uh, uh, if you think about we only got Faf back. Uh, he trained with us on Monday. Lewis only trained with us on Monday. Jasper only started training with us on Monday. So that's why I said during the week, uh, in the press conference, listen, we tried to pick a balance. Some guys that we worked with uh, for three weeks and some of them uh, that we haven't worked with for three weeks and then some youngsters and then some older guys. So we tried to pick a balance uh, uh, between not only selecting all the guys that we worked with for three weeks. You know, We, 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 we are obviously building into the season uh, and, and that's what we tried to do uh, today. Yeah. Uh, sorry. 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 Go on, go on. Last question, guys, and then we're done. Um, unfortunately, we have to wrap it up. Wales have to come in. Dark, I get that the net of frog. The the hot of the span. But 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 the the spirit is plastic competition spirits, and the other the hot is 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 is. What's here? Your work on so. Now the structure and the structure, your structure, but your body. Vooral in the begin van die toets zijn symbols. Nou, is het is het daar ook over in? Um, ek dink nie, kyk, d- hoe kan ek vir jou sê, ek dink, uh, d- die uitdaging is nie om met die spelers oor see speel nie. Uh, ek was na die dag by, by die Billese coaching kliniek en ek, vir, ek bedoel, ek kan nou enige game kry, drie ure na die die game gespeel is, kan ek nou allemaal sy tackles, passes, kyk, recht oor die wereld. So ek dink nie, dit is een issue 
met die spelers wat oorsee is nie, en as jy denk, die enigste spelers wat ons nie gekry het nie, is die ouwens wat of nog in die finaal gespeel het, soos Andrei, of dit is die, 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 die ouwens van die premiership. Japan, ons het in spelers gehad, Frankrijk, die spelers soos hulle uitgeval het, het ons hulle gekry, ek denk is maar die self vir, vir, vir enige ander land, jy weet, Engeland het hulle spelers ook maar gekry, soos hulle uit die competitie uitgeval het, hulle competitie het miskien bykie vroeger klaargemaak as, as ons in, maar um, ja, so ek denk, uh, dit is maar die self vir allemaal. Sorry guys, no we really have to wrap it up, we'll have to come in. Thank you, thank you so much.